Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map according to 272win.com. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe. Hello everyone, this is your highly esteemed President Ross. Today we have a doozy for you on this election map. For the Democrats, we have Washington State with 12 electoral votes. Kamala Harris is winning that one. Oregon with 8 electoral votes is for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is for Kamala Harris. Alaska with 3 electoral votes is Donald J. Trump State. Montana with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada, with six electoral votes, is currently grayed out for uh, 270towin.com. It will not be colored in. It is such a close race there. Utah, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Arizona, it's a close battle, according to 270towin.com. It has 11 electoral votes. It is grayed out. It will not be colored in because it's anyone's guess as to who will win this state. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico with 5 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Texas with 40 electoral votes is a deep red for Donald J. Trump. We thought we lost him in 2020 and he's coming back with a vengeance, Holmes, as Will Smith says, after he punches Chris Rock on stage. North Dakota with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. The first district of Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump. And the littlest district, the little baby, the little gray-gray is blue for Kamala Harris. Kansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma with seven electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Minnesota with 10 electoral votes and Tampon Timothy is blue for Kamala Harris. Wisconsin with 10 electoral votes and Michigan with 15 electoral votes next to it are both grayed out on 270towin.com. These stats, by the way, are from September 26th at 2100 hours. So yesterday or two days ago, depending on when we decide to publish this video, these are updated on 270towin.com. We are not making these states up. Iowa, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri, with ten electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana, with eight electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Illinois, with 19 electoral votes, is deep blue for Kamala Harris. Thank you. Chicago. Ha <laughs> ha. And now, Indiana is red for Donald J. Trump with 11 electoral votes. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. West Virginia with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with 8 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with 6 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Alabama, sweet home cousin lover state with 9 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Florida, with 30 electoral votes, is a bright pink for Donald J. Trump. But you know what? It's slowly flip-flopping every day, according to 270towin.com. And let's get this more accurate. Iowa, with six electoral votes, is actually a light pink as well for Donald J. Trump. It flip-flops on 270towin.com as well. And they even show Texas, with four electoral votes, as a light pink. One click. And there we go. That is more accurate. I apologize for that, ladies and gentlemen. It's kind of hard to see this picture I took. Uh, Georgia, with 16 electoral votes, is grayed out. It's a battleground state. It's a toss-up. Either or could win it. It will not be colored in. South Carolina, with 9 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. North Carolina, a battleground state, a heavy battleground state with Georgia, is grayed out on 270towin.com. It will not be colored in. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is a light blue, according to 270win.com. Light blue right there. And Pennsylvania with 19 electoral votes is grayed out. It will not be colored in. It flip-flops daily between Donald J. Trump and Kamala Harris. 
As for everything else except for the 1st District of Maine, the 1st District of Maine is currently red for Donald J. Trump. The state as a whole is blue for Kamala Harris. It flip-flops every so often. The rest of it is blue for Kamala Harris except for P.A. What do you guys think of these back and forth polls? Are you sick of them yet? Are you confused? Do you not know how to feel? Are you just as stressed out as everybody else is? Because I know I certainly am. And Hawaii with four electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. This puts her at 221 and Donald J. Trump at 217 with all the toss-ups and everything in between. And we also have D.C. with three electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris, which leads her with 224 electoral votes and Donald J. Trump with 217. I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are out. Burnt out.